I don't know if you can see this well, and if you can't, um, there's a person, and she's reading a book, and the book is called Never Eat Alone, and she is eating alone. This is an example of the difference between enthusiasm and commitment. Now, what's the backstory on this? I must admit, it was a little weird I took this photo. <laughs> so that's on me, right? Judge me as you will. There's certain things you can't let go, right? What do you do? Just choose your own adventure. I chose to take a photo that I will use in presentations for years, and I have. I took this photo in 2007. I'm still using it. I think that was the right move. You might disagree. That's okay. But let me give you some backstory on why this is the difference between enthusiasm and commitment. The backstory is she had just listened to a keynote presentation from an author. <laughs> Not me, different guy, this guy, Keith Ferrazzi, who wrote a book called Never Eat Alone. And the message was that our success in life comes from our network. It's an awesome, powerful message. And she had listened to him speak at a conference. And I know this because at her feet was the same tote bag that I had at my feet. I was not eating alone, so I felt like I was good. <laughs> there were about 10 other similar tote bags in this airport restaurant. So she obviously had enough enthusiasm to pull out the book on her way home from this conference, where she had seen this keynote speaker, bought the book, and now she's ready, right? Just like you'd seen the keynote speaker, and you have the book, and now you're ready. But I think you can see the difference between enthusiasm and commitment here. Enthusiasm is, I can't wait to read this book. What a powerful message. This really resonated with me. That's this scene right here. I think you also understand what commitment looks like. Ten other tote bags in the room, just like hers. Any one of them might have been willing to have dinner with her and have a conversation about what we just talked about. That would have been commitment. 